Welcome everyone, my name is John Life, and welcome back to another Wizard 101 video. Today's Wizard 101 video is going to be John looking at all of his characters on his account. So, you guys actually never seen all the characters and seen some of their stats, so this is what you, you guys are going to see uh, for this video today, because I never did show you guys it, and I wanted to show you guys it, so... We're going to really quickly go through all the stats for you guys and uh, for you guys to see all the uh, characters that John has and what's on them because I don't remember what's on every single character so that's what we're going to do. Let's go. So starting off with Kevin, basically what Kevin has is, I didn't up update you on this, um, but if you never knew, um, I never did have the Elf and Omega ring. We farmed that the first time and I got that back on last week. Uh, I want to say a big thanks to Erica because she helped me on that, so thank you, Erica. Uh, so that was the farm. That's good. That helped my damage and my block and pips and health a lot and the incoming. Uh, so that was really good. Another exciting thing that happened is my pet got to mega, everybody. Hype for that. It did not fail. It got... Well, wait, was that pet always mega? Okay, no, no, no. I got a jewel. So I got a damage duel, as you guys can see there. Uh, that's pretty good, damage jewel. Uh, that's what I wanted, so happy on that. So there's a three damage duel and duel, sorry, duel. Um, really nothing else. All the regular gears you guys know of, so I'm not really gonna show you guys that because you guys know about them. And yes, that's basically all from Kevin. Uh, 101 damage, 44 resistance, 21 accuracy. Damage is really good. Uh, crit's not bad. 470, 345 block, and uh, not too bad stats overall. Uh, you guys know the spells, um, you guys have seen that, I went over them. So that was Kevin, I'll see you guys at the next character. Hopping over to our buddy James Thunder, now I did a character update on, on him recently, so you guys probably know a lot about James, we basically left off here last in the daily assignment, if you guys didn't watch it, go check that, it'll be in the description below, but... Let's start off with James here. So let's get into the gear. I do not believe there isn't much updates on James besides that I've been farming Tartarus lately. So Poseidon's Torp, yes, basically a lot of the Tartarus gear. Uh, I really want the robe, but I have a robe here. But it kind of affects my resistance, and I don't want it to affect my resistance. Uh, but I might wear that. Tell me if you guys think I should wear that instead of the Sky Scream cape. Black Thunder Walker is the best you can get at level 90 so far. The wand you guys know about. Um, Bear Claw Storm. I think I want to update that to Cronus's. I really want to get Cronus's. Uh, I really want to get Cronus's uh, fame. Not too bad. Pet's really good. Lots of damage involved in there. Really, really good. Triple damage basically with the socket there. Really good double resistance. Um, let's check the stats out. 108 damage. Now you guys have to admit that is a lot of damage for Storm. 108 uh, resistance. We have 32. Accuracy is amazing. 27. 295 crit. Quite low for my level. 171 block. That's not too bad. 25%. Uh, Pierce is just overly all horrible. 87% uh, power pip, not too bad, 23% incoming. Uh, I had my spam deck on, as you guys know. And you guys know all the spells as well for him. So that was James Thunder, I'll see you at the next character. We are making our way on to the one and only Kevin Icebreaker. Everyone, you probably do know him uh, from the full game walkthrough. We really haven't went over his gear, but now you guys get to see. Kevin Icebreaker, we left off back here in um, Mushu. With the full game walkthrough, so I'm gonna put him right here, and we're gonna go through it. So start off with the gear. Starting off, he's with the Meowdy Icy Cap. I do want to continue doing Mount Olympus, guys, uh, to get better gear. Now you guys are saying, "Oh my John, you better get going on that Mount Olympus." I will get going on that, guys. Uh, that's what I got so far for the hat. Senators Wintry Toga, not too bad. That's one of the best out of that level. Uh, Nalo's Leary Shoes could be better. Once again, I could have gotten more of the Mount Olympus if I worked harder. 
Sky Iron Host everybody knows about. Uh, these aren't really important at this level, to be honest, but if you guys want to pause it. Uh, but yeah, that's basically all, and you guys seen his spells many, many times. Uh, I think I gotta get a couple new spells on him anyway. But yeah, that was basically, uh, Kevin Icebreaker, guys, so I'll see you guys at the next one. Alright, guys, so you guys never heard of him. Uh, he was just on the stream at one time, and I just started leveling him. This is Mark Skyflim, guys. Uh, you guys never heard of him. That's exactly why I wanted to bring him in for you guys actually know him. Now, what I want you guys to do for Mark Skyflame, if you're watching this video, comment down below your TFCs, guys. I will accept your TFCs on this character. Now, it doesn't mean I get on him a lot, so the people that really, really couldn't meet me, send your TFCs and I will get back to them before 24 hours ends. I promise that I will get to those true friend codes before 24 hours. I promise you that, guys. I watch my notifications. As you guys know that because I find commenting back to you guys the most important thing uh, for you guys to know that I'm not just leaving you in the dust. So comment down below your TFCs. Now let's get on to his gear. Now his gear is not good. Once again, his, near, his gear is not good, guys. So go easy on him. I did not work on any Mount Olympus gear on him. Oh, yeah, I did. <laughs> so my bad, yeah, I did. So that's one Mount Olympus gear. That is not a Mount Olympus gear. That is... I don't even know why I got that robe, to be honest. But I'm going to show you guys them. I don't even know I had a... I don't even know. Sky Iron, a Hasta, and all of the... What? I have a 5 amulet? Ooh. Oh, I... Ooh, I, I didn't know I had these. Oh. Cool. I have any months in it. I love my fire Alright, let's go through the spells real quick. Pekan, Pixie, a lot of the normal original stuff for a fire at this level. Um, I got the Ninja Pigs from something. I think it dropped and I got the spell. I don't know where I got it from. Sorry for those balance people out I mean, those myth people out there that always wanted the Ninja Pig. I just randomly got dropped from it. Um, but that was cool. But yeah, that was basically him. Let's go through his stats really quickly. 28 damage on fire. Not much resistance. Accuracy is alright for that level. And 36% power pip and 3% incoming, not really much. By the way, if my voice is a little down, that is because it is late at night and I'm recording a video. Uh, if I can get it up for you guys tomorrow. So that is all for him. I'll see you guys at the next character. Alright, so some of you guys might know Cody. Cody is my level 20 death. Uh, I did do a 1 PvP and a lot of people are wondering where that is since August. Guys, I'm, I don't know if I'll continue that PvP thing. I failed so hardcore on the first one. It just made me not want to do it again. But you guys should know Cody from that video. This is Cody. Or from the stream in general. Or from the meet and greet from Cody. Cody, this is Cody. Everybody should. I don't even know this people on. Okay. So. There isn't really much about him besides that he got all of the good crown gear. Because I knew I was going to PvP on him. And I kind of had him set. In a way, I kind of had him set. The best that I could get him. Uh, but yeah. He was not the best best set, but uh, as you guys see, he did have some pretty good TFs, uh, TCs in here that I did kind of have set up for him, but I just kind of gave up on it, guys. Uh, but those are the normal spells. And that is his gear. 2 damage, 10 resistance, 1 accuracy. 22% uh, power pip. So, yeah, that was basically Cody. I'll see you guys at the next character. Alright, guys, we are here at the one and only, everybody should know him, Jonathan Life. The guy, the character, the name that started this entire channel, everybody. He was the one that started on Wiz. He was the first character I ever picked on Wizard 101, guys, when I first started the game. He was the first YouTube, you know, that's where I came up with the name, guys. Exactly right from that character. This character, right here, everybody. Jonathan Life. I just shortened it to John Life. But Jonathan Life was the first character. And a lot of you guys should know him. A lot of people have him added. He is an amazing life. I enjoy, enjoy playing him. Um, you know, I'm glad when people, you know, notice him. Alright, so Jonathan Life is in Polaris. 
So let's take a look at his gear. Now Jonathan Life is set up with all of the Jade Hood mystery gear uh, due to that omen battle we did. Uh, but he's definitely stacked up for Jade. He does have all of the uh, Waterworks gear, which is pretty good for life for now. Uh, and a lot of people were wondering, where did I get this one? I got it from the bazaar and basically stitched it. This is for his attack, uh, freaking attack. Really, really good. I can't wait to get 90 to get the next one. This is more of an outgoing one, and that's the damage. That's just for resistance and the healing. Once again, the outgoing again. Pet is basically a balanced kind of pet, but pretty good because of the double resistance. And that's that. Let's take a look at the stats real quick here. 70 resistance. Now remember guys, this is my Jade. 70 resistance. That's an incredible 33 jewel resistance. Uh, 21 critical for all schools besides balance due to that pet. 198. 198 block. I believe he's mega. I don't know what he unlocked. I thought he unlocked something mega. I feel like I got him something mega, but I don't know. 198 block, not bad at all. 91% outgoing. That is incredible. The power pips are a lot lower than I want to, but that's okay. It's more about those 91% outgoing guys. I get a lot of people asking me, can you please heal and tank? I like that. And this is the setup for Jonathan Life, guys. An amazing setup. I don't know why I have an absorber there. I normally don't. I think that was from Omen because I was silly that time. But what an amazing set deck deck setup that Jonathan has for the healing guys. Look at that. Can't get any better than that. I believe he does have an attacking deck. I don't know which one it is. That's another healing one. And that's basically the that is basically the damage deck that I have. Uh, I got fluffy. Faints, blades, regular blades. So he's pretty set up as well. Set it back just in case. I don't know why that's not locked anyway. Oh, it is okay. But yeah, that was basically Jonathan Life as well. So guys, that was all of the characters that you guys seen on John Life. Uh, all the characters that are on this account. Now, you guys never seen them. If you guys have any questions, comment down below. I will surely answer them. Remember, 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 TFC from Mark Skyflim. If you want to meet me, I'll get on there sometime and I can talk to you all. So, that's going to wrap it up for this video, guys. If you guys did enjoy, please leave a big like. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. Punch the subscribe button in the face right now for awesome content. So, once again, thank you everybody so much for watching. Please subscribe, comment, like, and share. And you guys know it. I'll catch you in the next video. Goodbye, guys.